and welcome back to Wasteland 2 Early Access Beta. I'm Mal, and I'll be your host. Alright, let's get back into it. As you can see, I just called in, and we're going to assign some points here. Let's start with Arlo. I think, uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and get some more Assault Rifle for him. Uh, he does have 10 action points, so being able to take two single shots with him comes in handy when I'm trying to conserve ammo. And, you know, he is one of my primary combatants, so makes sense. Alright, let's take a look at Stafford. Uh, hmm. I guess I could take some more... Mechanical repair? I don't know. Uh, let's see. Summer, I think... Handguns? I've been using that quite a bit. Or I could just hold off. And go for more sniper skill. Hmm. What do you guys think? I can, I'm going to think about that a little bit. Let's see. What do we got with Angela? Uh, so I finally have points to spend on her. I Actually, with her, though, I don't know that there's really anything pressing that I need. I think I'm just going to hold on to everything for now. I can change points on the fly if I need it, like I did earlier with Stafford, which I recommend. You know, on one of your characters, you might want to keep just a few points available so that you can do that whenever you need to. You know, like I didn't have mechanical repair, I had points available, so, you know, all of a sudden, Stafford knows how to repair stuff. Alright, let's go back. I want to take a look, make sure... I haven't missed anything. I still want to go back through where that, um, you know, that cargo container is, where you have the, uh, yeah, you know, where you have that that freight, that freight, that freight uh, train or freight car that could be moved by the tr by the uh, crane. I still want to go into that cave because it appears to be the alternative entrance into the uh, the prison. As someone pointed out too, um, <laughs> I could have uh, I could have taken a different way in uh, instead of fighting those guys directly at this gate. I could have bashed down. I had found another way to sort of like sneak back around them, but eh, it was fine. It worked out. Neither of these codes that I have to get into Red's place are working. The one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, or code can't use the computer bypass thing on it. It doesn't seem to do anything. And nothing else I've tried. I've tried a couple different things off camera. Nothing seems to work. As you can see here. But... Maybe, uh... Hmm. Just because the computer hacking thing doesn't work on... This thing with red... Oh, those, that's where the sheep are. Okay. How the hell do you get up there? Or goats, or whatever the hell they are. Uh, okay, how do I get up there? Anyway, like I was saying, I... I, um... <laughs> I lost my train of thought. Oh, I, I think I can use a computer... Um, computer skill to open up that... Uh, controls for that crane to move that uh, freight car. So I think I'll... I'm going to go over here and investigate this real quick, and then I'm going to go back. I think I'll go back down there to see if that really does work. What is the way through here? Hmm. Talk to her again? I'm not sure. Hmm. Okay, well, I'm going to make a quick cut and I'll come back to you when I'm back over there and giving things a try with the uh, 
um, computer skill on the uh, controls for the crane. All right, I'll be back to you in just a second. Okay, here we go. Yep, 100%. Simple. Alright. I should have tried that earlier, I guess. But hey, better, better, better than never, right? <laughs> At least I gave it a whirl. Okay, so the crane should lift that thing out of the way. We should be able to go into the cave, right? There we go. Mm-hmm. Uh, can we walk? Ah, uh, it doesn't matter. I was gonna say we could walk across that, but I've already been over there. Alright, so let's go into the cave and scope this out. Oh, if I'm right, this is under the prison, and we should come up on some of these guys. Alright, let's break our way through that. Let's get Angela over here. Crates for storage. Oh, a locker. All right. We'll take loot. Nice. We like the free loots. Again, I heard someone. Footsteps. Oh, there we go. Red Scorpion Militia. All right, now let's see if we can move up. Red Scorpion Militia. Another red scorpion militia. Okay, let's let's see if we can scooch up here a little bit and try to be sneaky and get into some decent positions. Okay, what do we got down here? Red scorpion militia. So that's another heavy gunner guy with 70 hit points and some grenadiers. Okay, let's get set up. Okay, Angela, no, 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 no. Okay, change stance. Let's see, Arlo. Yeah, you can hang out here. Change your stance. Angela can go hang out over here. Ah, oh, crap. Well, we got partially set up anyway. Do I take cover? Yeah. Makes sense. The 
this guy or the... I should be out of the range of the Grenadier guys, right? At least for this turn. Well, that's kind of the gamble I'm taking anyway. I'm going to go for... Uh, how come I can't hit that guy? Oh, yeah. Okay. So that's one of the things you need to keep in mind. If you have an enemy that's like on the red range circle, like he's like, like it's cutting through him, that he's not in range. The entire enemy has to be inside the circle. What? Really? One hit? Come on. <laughs> one hit point. Ah. It hates me. Why do you hate me? All right, let's go get some cover. I don't think staying up here is a good idea at all. Can I get anywhere and still take a shot? Here. But I don't... That's not a good idea, I don't think. I guess I could... Actually, I could fall back to there and still take, like, a pistol shot or something, potentially. Yeah, I think that's probably a better idea. 16%. Or is that 18%? I don't know. Oh, and I shoot my own guy for 10. Great. Good job. Oh, you see that? Oh, that's awesome. They got like a pig or something on the rotisserie. <laughs> I caught him at dinner. Yeah, that's right. Get some. Okay, I should, I really should get a couple of these people handguns. Because there's that extra, like, three or four AP that they could be, you know, they could be shooting at range. Like, the melee's nice, don't get me wrong, but, you know, in each fight, you only get, like, one or two opportunities, generally speaking, to do the melee effectively. Oh, should we do a rocket? I think we should. We've been waiting it. We've been waiting. That's a good rocket shot right there. Yeah! <laughs> oh, okay. That was that was very satisfying. Oh, now why why really what was it one hit point again? Okay, that's sort of ridiculous. <laughs> okay, all right. I guess I'll go to. I guess I'll go to single shots. Okay. Oh, please be out of movement. Okay, I was gonna say. Please don't be able to shoot. Uh, uh, uh. Oh. Holy crap. Did you see how far that, those guys are throwing those grenades? That's ridiculous. Holy crap. Okay, well, they're a bigger priority than I thought they were then. But we need to take this heavy machine gunner guy down. Uh... Two hit points. Wow. The, the game is is trolling me in this fight. It is. Why? I don't know. I didn't do anything to hit. Okay. Come on. Let's take someone out. Uh, yeah. Nice. Okay. Good. The Grenadiers are a pain in the ass because not only do they uh, do decent damage, but you get the additional problem of they destroy the soft cover, right? So things like crates and stuff can be destroyed by that. I should probably take a single shot at this dude. Finish him off. There we go. And this guy too. There we go. There we go. Switch weapons. And let's go hatchet to the face. Yeah, you like that? How about that? All right. Good job, Stafford. Oh, please hit. No, no chance. Go for cover instead. All right. Let's move up. We have a decent to hit. Nice. 
How much XP did we get off of that total? Oh, pretty nice. Pretty nice. Okay, well, we didn't get hurt as bad as I thought we did. I thought we got hurt quite a bit more than that. We got several promotions out of the deal, so that was cool. You get so much experience from these guys, it's like ridiculous. Alright, well, I think what I'll do here is I'll loot... Yeah, I'll loot everything up and then I'll come back to you in the next video. So I hope you like this one. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Mal, and I will see you later.